cooks it fairly fast, you know. It is pretty thin. What we're doing here is I'm cutting a 18 inch section out of this rack that's made out of this angle iron. And then I'm gonna take the uh, rack and reconnect it because I need the rack to be, be about a uh, foot and a half shorter so it'll fit. We're gonna use this as a rack to hold up uh, water filtration equipment and a water heater, keep it off the ground. And I uh, had this thing already made for another purpose, but it was just a little too big. So I'm gonna cut this piece out and then weld it back together. And then I'll just show you the steps I'm doing with the welding and how that goes.
So we got the rack shortened, we were able to cut out 18 inches of length on each side there, and then actually use those same pieces to just weld them together and, and across to give this some strength. We're gonna put uh, three quarter inch plywood on top of this, and then on top of this we'll go some water heater, water filtration, and water softener equipment just to keep it up off the ground. And uh, but uh, rewalded it, got it to um, be the right length that we needed, and then did a quick paint job and uh, ready to go. But real happy with, with how that little project came out.